So 135, now that everybody's moved up to 135, you, Devin, um, T.O. Well, we were 40. Uh, 40. Yeah, you guys moved up from 35 yeah. to yeah, 40, yeah. right? Yeah, I mean, Subriel's kind of a monster now. Uh, he's starting to get some notoriety. I mean, he's always been, but do you see a world where Tank's got to go up to 140 at one point or another? Because I, at it is this point, bro, I ain't dead, even bro. worried about Tank, bro. No more. Tank got to be worried about us, bro. Tank's going to fall off because... He thinks that playing that cool bullshit works, bro. Nobody thinks that's cool anymore, bro. Like, you got to be vocal. You got to be ready for the smoke, bro. You got to be ready to fight, bro. If you're not ready to really fight, then we're going to forget about you, bro. Because Javante Davis, you're not that special, bro. Like, if you don't fight nobody, nobody going to watch you, bro. It's fast. Fast. I mean, sooner or later, you're going to have to fight people. Because after, mean, it, after it, Frank, who is there, right? Shakur, but bro, nobody's going to nobody's gonna really want to watch that, bro. He, you're going to see that, bro. His numbers are not going to do that good against Frank, bro. I guarantee you, bro. You got, Everybody could go and lie all they want. I know he has a bunch of, you know, stands out there that, you know, like fake his numbers and stuff. But it ain't going to be good, bro. I guarantee you, bro. bro. Just not. It's not. It's not. It's not going to be good, bro. He's going to have to see one of us. If it ain't me, it's going to be somebody else. Be. Yeah, he has to fight me, bro. It's the only way he's gonna make thirty million dollars in one night. It's the only way. I mean, it's the only damn way. I'm just I'm saying, at, like thirty five's getting dried out. You, you know, know what, what I mean? Even, like, you know, it's yeah, because we moved up, bro. The the talent moves up. Everybody got to move up. Like nobody's going down to thirty five, bro. You look at Cruz went up to forty. Everybody's going up, bro. Like nobody's worried about whatever Javante Davis is doing, bro. Like, I guarantee you nobody's worried about him. And I'm telling you, bro, if he wants to see me at 140, we could do it next. But he's not, bro. He's not going to do it because he cannot take this, this energy, bro. He, I know he just can't take it, bro. He can't take it. Um, they did – I'm telling you, they did everything they can to, like, try to disable me before entering that ring, bro. And I went in there and walked in there with a smile and left with a smile. And I made $30 million in one night. After, bro, I almost died making weight. Facts. I almost died making weight. And I came and I just fought through it all. And now look at where I'm at. 25 years old. I could retire tomorrow if I wanted to, but I don't. Because I got a big mission. And right now, we're going to knock out Devin Haney. Shout out Relax for that great question. Uppercut. Remember how I said that in the eighth. Big uppercut. And get wild, night night for Devin. <laughs> if I could show you my full sparrings, I would, but I can't. Oh, I would show you guys so bad. You guys would be like, this man is different right now. But I can do that. You posted that video of you knocking no, that dude that's down. That's not even, bro. That's. It would change the betting. It would change the betting, right? It would change the betting, absolutely. You think so? Absolutely. Yeah. But we're not going to do that. No, no, no. Yeah. Yo, Keem's back. Let Vegas, let Vegas be Vegas. Let Vegas be Vegas. No, I think it's I think it's brilliant. But I had another question, Ryan. During okay. You've been more uh, outspoken than you've ever been. Yes. What What is happening? I'm, I'm sure your management and, you know, all your handlers had issues. But what about the coaching staff? Did your coaching staff mention any of this stuff? Did they give you any pushback? The only one, I mean, Derek obviously wants me to, you know, stay focused. Derek's been on me um, more so than anybody. He's, you know, he's been uh, just pushing me to, like, when I come in the gym, he don't want to hear none of it. And I don't. You know, I go in the gym. I do my job. You know, I, I get, you know, the work done. And I don't I don't really do anything. You know, I don't speak about what I speak about, you know, uh, online to, to, you know, I don't bring that into the boxing space, if that makes sense. Makes sense. Makes sense. Yeah. So, yeah, everything's going pretty well, though. Are you not feeling the pressure for this one? Because I feel like, look, you've been in some very big stages uh, throughout yeah. your boxing career. But this one has more promotion and more hype and more Ryan Garcia being talked about than ever before. Yeah, bro. This is um. I don't feel the pressure though. I feel like I feel light as a feather. I'm just ready to do this. I'm ready to do my job, bro. Four twenty is gonna be great. And um, again, bro. I mean, I'm just happy, bro. I'm in a fight. I I'm at a good weight, 
you know, it's not like I'm killing myself to make the weight. I'm strong, bro. It's 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 very hard to beat me. Like at, at my fullest capacity, you know, my full like my full strength. I don't think anybody could beat me. I just don't. I don't see it. And um, you know, he's gonna have to prove me wrong. I don't think De Devin Haney will not beat me. Um, me at my full strength is just too much. This is at one forty in and not yeah, one thirty five. Yeah, nah, bro. Like you know, the weight cut that could kill, man. You know, just the weight cut. So um, I'm at a great weight right now. I'm feeling great. And I'm ready to do my job. How do you mentally cut weight? Like I, <laughs> I feel like every person, even on here, at some point has been on a diet or tried to lose a few pounds, and it's a battle. Like try I don't understand. Thing. I tried how thing. these. You got to try this thing called um, Bulletproof Coffee. Oh, yeah, with the butter? We lost him. We lost him. The Illuminati got him. If you Go really want to know the secrets, then sign up to the Ryan Garcia app. Yeah, facts. facts. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> sign up. We got di in. different uh, price compilations available. Back to you guys. Are, are you talking about the coffee that you put, like, either butter or oil in the coffee? No, so it's, ba the, it's basically like a – it's a – it has a lot of things in it. I, I don't know – like, my coach makes it for me. But you don't get hungry. It's better than Ozempic. And I never took an Ozempic. I don't even know what Ozempic is. I wouldn't – I wouldn't tell anybody to take that because I just don't know what it is. But um, basically, bro, like, I don't get hungry. And uh, I fast almost all day. I train hard. I have a lot of energy. It's just, it's really fire, bro. It's really fire. And I might even go run. What? Because the thing with me, though, I could run like running to me is like walking. I could run 12 miles in one day and it wouldn't even feel like I did anything. My security's right here. He could vouch for that. Fast. Like literally. He, they even get shocked. Like, bro, how do you do it? Like, like I could go out all night, right? All night till five o'clock in the morning, and I wake up and be like, all right, let's go run. They're like, what the fuck? And I'll be like, yo, twelve miles right now, and then I'll do it like nothing happened, huh? <laughs> and you be tripping up. <laughs> like not even a hey, bro, and I'm laughing while running. Bro, taking pictures with people. It's like, what's up? Bro, it's hilarious, but um, all glory to God. I don't know what you got in your head. I know you keep saying that uh, whatever whatever yeah. God says is what's going to happen, but I, I'm thinking round eight, bro. That's what Thank I'm saying. Thank you, bro. Yeah, man, I, I'm looking real good, bro. Um, yeah, there's a lot of people out there commenting and stuff saying you a clone because your speed's going down. You was hitting that heavy bag, but, bro, it's like you're training your yeah. power. I don't understand. People don't like, understand. My, your speed obviously all, didn't go nowhere. My coach don't like me to do the extras on the bag anyways. He doesn't let me go as hard as I want to go at times. He wants me to work more on technique. So, again, I, I mean, I, I don't have to prove myself to anybody. I know I know what I'm – I know what I do. Yeah, it's like, brother, since you was like, what, 16, 17, you was out here posting videos. Like, the speed is there. That's yeah. not going anywhere. You got to train other yeah. stuff. That's understandable. Exactly. Like – 